Welcome back to my channel. So for today, I would just like to share um, some of my favorite pairs of designer shoes that I wear very often. And um, I will just show you a clip of a quick little unboxing I did for the Valentino slippers that I got on sale uh, from my Theresa. So even though I just got them, I know that I'll be wearing them regularly. So I got the ones in black with the grainy leather. Uh, similar to my uh, maroon pair, the ones in heels. So also at Valentino, so I really like the rock stud. So if you follow my Instagram, you will see that I'm always wearing my rock stud shoes. So I have my latest shoe purchase, guys, from my Theresa. So this is the folder with the receipts, etc. Return forms and the yellow my Theresa box. So they always pack it really nicely. So here, uh, I think Beatrice, the one who packed. And I just got a pair of Valentino slippers that were on sale. So I really couldn't resist because the price was really, really good. Let me quickly show you, as usual, the dust bag with the card, I think. Nicely wrapped in tissue paper and ta-da! These are my Gucci, no sorry, Valentino slippers. They look so cool and chic. I've seen people wearing it um, in outside so i really want to get a pair and i got a black pair so these are the rock studs i mean a rock stud design is flat i think it should be pretty comfortable i got size 39 my usual size for valentino this pair the latest one which are the flat slippers which you just slip on so i'll show modeling um i'll insert the modeling clip and then I have this pair, the fuchsia pink ones that I've had for I think more than a year already. So these are the caged flats. In terms of comfort, this is not that comfortable because it's um very pointed as you can see. But I just love the color and um you know this I love shiny leather, the pattern style. So it's quite different from the grainy leather that you can see here. These slippers seem to be quite um comfortable because they are quite flat and it doesn't have the uh, strap the ankle strap so it's very much easier to wear compared to the caged flats so the other pair that i have here are uh is my also the valentine also valentino obviously a rock stud but um rock studs which are in i think it's a maroon color i'm not sure that, what the exact shape uh, is called but this uh, these are quite high, about four, uh, four and a half inches. So they're not very comfortable just because of the height, but they're really, I really love them. So I would, I always wear them when I know that I don't need to walk that much. So definitely not for shopping, but for dinners or lunches where you mostly be sitting down it would be better. Um, for me at least. Sometimes I do wear them to work when I know I'm not gonna be, you know, um, basically running around too much. So because they are. I do love them. They're very um, chic and fashionable and very um, professional as well because there are not that many studs but it does add a bit of a zing to your outfit. So I love the um, rock studs as you can see from Valentino. So uh, going back to this one because this is really flat uh, as in if you have an arch in your feet it's better if you add in the um, something like this which is for the sole uh, here that's what I do and it just makes it easier to walk and the thing uh, I love these pair of this pair of shoes but it's just that the ankle strap etc it is quite, quite um, difficult to wear sometimes but uh, yeah oh no I think it definitely adds a very very edgy look to your outfit with the where, with, when you have the rock studs okay so next I'll go oh, before I go into my two uh, pairs of flats. I just love uh, this is my only pair and first and only pair of Roger Vivier shoes for now So I you know, I love metallics. I love I loved this silver color when I saw it on my Theresa website So this is very um, blue is very much blue tone silver has the signature uh, Roger Vivier buckle as you can see uh, th this pair of heels uh, are actually quite comfortable because the height is only about two and a half inches if I'm not mistaken. I got it from my Theresa website. These were not on sale but uh, I just wanted to have them. Yeah, so I got them. And this is actually um, cheaper than if you buy them from the Roger Vivier store uh, in my country which is in Malaysia. So I thought 
I would get these even um, and I do pay I have to pay 10% customs charges for anything I order from my Theresa so okay so I will also show the um, some pictures I have um, of this pair of shoes when I was wearing them when I was out and then another pair that I've been uh, I just got actually but I've already worn a few times uh, the Faragamo classic flats, the Verena flats with the bow. I actually got these on sale 30% and I just showed it in my previous video. This is in the bone color and I just love this color. It's patent leather. It's um quite, re I mean it's relatively comfortable because it's a round toe as you can see. So these are just classic and never, you know, run out of style. You know, they are okay for work, okay for going out. They're quite conservative and very ladylike. So I do like them. And last but not least are my Fuchsia her Chanel Ballerinas. So these are the classic ones and they I don't think these go on sale actually. So I got these at full price uh, I think about a few months ago from Chanel KLCC. So I love this color. There was another coral color but they didn't have that in my size. So I just went with this pair. So these are actually quite comfortable as well because as you can see they are round toe. There's a CC logo embroidered here, the bow, the quilted um, leather. So I've tried to keep this quite clean. So far so good. I mean I don't, uh, I just wear them like to I guess cleaner places and yeah so far so good. I think the leather has been holding up quite well and it's quite comfortable. So the reason uh, I also missed out something, I think the reason that this uh, slipper is more comfortable than this is also because um, this is grainy leather as you can see so it's softer compared to the pattern leather which is harder so this would actually uh, be a bit more uncomfortable if you have to walk a lot in these so if you're more for comfort I would suggest that for rock studs you should get the uh, grainy leather because it's softer so um, I hope you liked this little video today. I just wanted to share a little bit about the shoes that I wear very often and I do think it's quite uh, worth it to get uh, designer shoes especially when you can get them on sale. So Valentinos usually do go on sale but um, if your size is popular they might just not have your size. That's it. Um, for Chanel um, classics they do not go on sale. I have another few pairs of Chanel heels that are very old so I won't bother showing them but uh, at times Chanel sale also has some heels but I don't think they have the ballerinas. Uh, Roger Vivier, because of the square toe, as you can see, is also quite comfortable uh, compared to the pointed toes. And a Roger Vivier, I think, also sometimes go on sale on my Theresa, but quite difficult to get um, popular sizes. So I do sometimes watch out for discount codes that my Theresa sends. They do send like private um, discount codes to selected customers randomly so that would be a uh, great times to utilize your codes and get um, the shoes that you have been watching out for so um if forgot about this pair um this is another pair of ferragamos that i have i also got these on sale from my theresa and then as you can see the heel is kind of like dirty and then there's like a scratch here because i brought this pair on a business trip um I just love the bows though. It is so ladylike. It's a bit different from the usual Verena bows. I'm not sure what they call this. Uh, but my size for this is um, size 9 and a half. So it depends on the cutting as you may know for Ferragamo. So you do need to uh, kind of know your size before you order online. So uh, rounded toes obviously uh, the cutting is looser. And I do love this pair. I will still wear them. I'll still wear them uh, probably mostly for work and they just go well with light colored outfits of course and very ladylike in my opinion so yeah yeah so thanks everyone for watching i hope to see you soon bye